Hey guys, Dan Nesta, McGrath Estate Agents, bringing you this week's weekly market wrap from home. We are in the middle of lockdown 5.0, certainly not where we wanna be, uh, but we've been here before. We know how to get through it and we will come out the other side. Uh, it means no more inspections for us over the course of the next week or so until next Wednesday. Unfortunately, we didn't get the news that we'd hoped for yesterday with the extension to the lockdown until uh, effectively next Wednesday morning, we'll reopen the doors. Uh, for our guys, not much changes. Our phones are still on, uh, we're all on email. So if you need to get in contact with us, please do. Uh, our guys are all busy on the phones over the course of the next week. And getting some of the stuff done that we otherwise find difficult to find the time for, um, it's a good chance for us to all catch our breath in what has been an incredibly busy market. And that's where I wanna really take this market wrap today. Not so much talk about the results of the last week within our office at McGrath Ballarat, but let's talk about Ballarat as a whole and what's happened in the market over the course of the last 12 months. So the REIV last Friday released their quarterly figures uh, for the quarter ending uh, June 2021. Uh, and what that told us was there was a 4.6% increase again for the previous quarter across the city of Ballarat. 14.5% uh, increase over the last 12 months. And what I wanted to say here is that I think that what we're gonna see over the next two quarterly releases uh, being September and again in December, I think that we're gonna find that that will increase again. So uh, when we consider what's happened over the last 12 months, the market only started to gain momentum around about last July. So that was when we got out of that lockdown, first locked, initial lockdown period, and the confidence in the consumers started to come back. That was when the market started to recover. What we found was that there was a build of momentum going up into Christmas, and then we wondered whether the market would continue to be as strong post Christmas. It got stronger, it found another gear. So what that tells us is that over the course of the next two quarterly uh, information releases, we're gonna find that that median house price will increase again. And that percentage increase over the last 12 months, I think we'll get to somewhere around about 20% by the time we get to December. Could even be a little bit more than that. So let's talk about some of the suburbs of Ballarat that have gone incredibly well over the course of the last 12 months. Delacombe up 21.3% to 452,000. Uh, Mount Helen up 21.1% to 560,000. Redan up 18.7% to 417,500. Still incredibly good value in Redan in my opinion. Uh, Lake Gardens up 16.5% to 670,000. We've seen some incredible results in Lake Gardens. And Wendoree up 14.4% to 392,500. I remember going back 2018, Wendoree, uh, Wendoree went through a period where they had a 24% increase between 2017 and 2018, and I thought that'll never happen again. It might be just about to happen again. So. Other thing that I wanted to talk about was the amount of sales that our office has made over the million dollar mark over the course of July 2021. So we're up to eight sales already this month negotiated. I think five of them are already unconditional, three of them are conditional sales that will drop uh, to unconditional status by the end of the month. Incredible, never seen those results ever in my career. Uh, I think we had a week there where we sold six properties, we negotiated six deals above a million bucks and that just shows goes to show what's happening across the board here in Ballarat. Like I said guys, phones are on, emails are ready. Uh, get in touch with us if you need to. Uh, we'll be making plenty of calls over the next week and uh, we hope to hear your smiling faces on the other side of the phone. Have a great week, stay safe and uh, see you on the other side. Cheers.